The Affordable Care Act, or Obamacare, is celebrating its 14th anniversary. Some Arizona leaders took to today to honor the health coverage it has granted them and others across the state. Cronkite News reporter Adriana Gonzalez-Chavez shares with us whose lives it has impacted. It took a while for me to really believe that this was true. And then, of course, I had no idea how much it was going to cost. But thankfully, I had good insurance through the Affordable Care Act, so I was able to pay what it took for me to be in remission today. Laura Packard is a stage 4 cancer survivor, and she says the Affordable Care Act saved her life and gave her one less thing to worry about. Once I hit the few thousand dollar cap, then I didn't have to pay anymore. So I would still get bills in the mail every day, but they were paid. Other Arizona leaders have a similar story. That without insurance, I would not have been able to afford the treatment that literally has kept me alive. I've had three reoccurrences. Uh, last week, I found out I'm cancer free, but the treatment continues. Arizona State Senator Leila Olston believes she would not be able to receive the quality care she has as a retired teacher if it was not for the Affordable Care Act. That is why she, alongside other Arizona organizations like Via the Soul Community Health Center and Children's Action Alliance, celebrated the act today. In 2024 alone, more than 348,000 Arizonans received health care coverage through the Affordable Care Act. Many fear that if it were to disappear, thousands of Arizonans would lose coverage. Back in 2010, the Goldwater Institute filed a lawsuit against the act, challenging its constitutionality. The Institute did not want to comment on the act today. In a recent article published by Arizona Mirror about the Affordable Care Act, Arizona Congressman Juan Siscamani said, The Republican Study Committee produces a number of common sense provisions. However, I do not subscribe to every proposal they put out. What best reflects my perspectives are the votes I take bills I introduce, and legislation I co-sponsor. In Phoenix, Adriana Gonzalez-Chavez, Cronkite News.